Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today in the face of God, family, and friends to join together Robert Burke and Patricia Cruz in holy matrimony, which is an honorable and solemn estate and therefore is not to be entered into unadvisedly or lightly, but reverently and soberly. Into this estate, these two individuals come now to be joined as one in Christ. If anyone can show just cause why they may not be lawfully joined together in this holy union, let them speak now or forever hold their peace. Who then gives this woman to be married to this man? I do. Robert, do you take Patricia to be your lawful wedded wife, to live in the holy estate of matrimony? Do you promise to love, honor, comfort, and cherish her from this day forward, forsaking all others, keeping only unto her for as long as you both shall live? Patricia, do you take Robert to be your lawful wedded husband, to live in the holy estate of matrimony? Do you promise to love, honor, comfort, and cherish him from this day forward, forsaking all others, keeping only unto him for as long as you both shall live? Robert, please repeat after me. I, Robert Burke. I, Robert Burke. Take thee, Patricia Cruz, Take thee, Patricia Cruz, to be my wedded wife, to be my wedded wife, to have and to hold, to have and to hold, from this day forward, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, in sickness and in health, to love, honor, and cherish, to love, honor, and cherish, till death do us part, till death do us part. On this day, on this day, I pledge to you, I pledge to you, my solemn vow, my solemn vow. Patricia, please repeat that. I, Patricia Cruz, take thee, Robert Burke, to be my wedded husband, to have and to hold. From this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love, honor, and cherish, till death do us part. On this day, I pledge to you my solemn vow. May I have the bride's ring for the best man?
Wedding bands signify a number of important elements in a couple's life. Eternal love, devotion, commitment, fidelity, honor and respect, and the bond of unity. It constitutes a legally binding agreement between husband and wife as the wife becomes subordinate to her husband and the husband swears to protect his wife. The wedding band's circular form with no beginning and no end symbolizes eternal union and endless love, a promise that cannot be broken. Its round shape is also associated with the sun and the earth, their wholeness and perfection representing the married couples sharing in peace and contentment. The bands are traditionally meld of metal as a symbol of strength in the marriage bond. Wearing the wedding ring on the fourth finger of the left hand is a habit born of the belief that blood from an artery on that particular finger flows directly to the heart. Hence, couples place each other's rings on the ring finger to symbolize true love that comes from and flows back directly to the heart. May this ring be blessed so he who gives it and she who wears it may abide in peace and continue in love until life's end. That's okay, well then I need to write it. There you go. This is the yeah, This is the supplement ring with the diamond. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Yeah. okay. Robert? This is our first time doing this. <laughs> Robert, while placing this ring on Patricia's finger, please repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. Wear it as a symbol. Wear it as a symbol of our love. Of our love and commitment. May this ring be blessed so that she who gives it and he who wears it may abide in peace and continue in love until life's end. Patricia, while placing this ring on Robert's finger, please repeat after me. <laughs> With this ring, With this ring I, thee I thee wed. Wear it as a symbol of our love and commitment. May this couple be prepared to continue to give, be able to forgive and experience more and more joy with each passing day, with each passing year. Robert and Patricia are now beginning their married life together. We hope that they may have blessed loving assistance from their family constant support of friends, and a long life with good health and everlasting love blessed by God. In so much as Robert and Patricia have consented to live forever together in wedlock and have witnessed the same before this company, having given and pledged their truth each to each other, and having declared same by the giving and receiving of a ring in the face of God, family, and friends, I pronounce that they are now husband and wife. Robert, you may now kiss your brother. <laughs>
It's happening to me I've already 